Why would you want to reward that? Why wouldn't you say, excuse me, could I get better management, please? I live here. I pay taxes here, and I'd like a job. Kevin O'Leary from Shark Tank, who we've shown you a bunch of clips lately. He's just been an absolute uh, truth teller that's working his way through mainstream media. I can't can only imagine how much longer they're going to allow that happen. Here he is on what's going on in her district itself. I look at AOC, what an incredible, incredibly successful politician she is, and what a horrific manager she is. Her, her jurisdiction looks like a third world country, and, and yet she's great at social media and, and making outrageous statements and getting $5 at a time on, you know, every way she can on social. Good for her. But wow, look what she did when Amazon came knocking for 10,000 Yeah, that to me blew my mind. How does that, I mean, you survive? So, so why would you want to reward that? Why wouldn't you say, excuse me, could I get better management, please? I live here. I pay taxes here and I'd like a job. And I don't think you're doing a great job for me as a manager. How about I hire somebody else? That's what I would encourage. Not that she isn't just great as a politician. There are countries that have weak leaders. There are states that have bad governors. I think people, the great thing about democracy is say, we can do better. Right. Putting up my head, let's do better. You think you, as you talk, I get this, not personal, it's just business. Just business. But everything is personal now. No, not for me. I mean, you. what you did right there is you gave her a compliment in terms of her, her showmanship and how she does well on social media. And she's be, her, she used her platform, and then you criticize the deed. You're like she's you lost. Yeah, you're not. And Ooh, that which, should. Be, which, but which that one makes is you. It? There's a lot of words I could throw. Oh, and I agree it. with you. I'll say it with you. I'll say it. I don't. I'm like, who voted for this? And you can see it across the board. You can see it. It doesn't have to be AOC. We. You could take it at a re well, super she's Republican a guy. Example. Yeah, but she's which, a perfect example. What did of I cares say about the that camera. wasn't true? Is she a great nothing? Well, she's a great politician. Let's celebrate that. Is she a bad manager? 100%. She's terrible. They're both true. They so if both she was true. a business, I wouldn't. Hear that. <laughs> you, would you Would you pass? Or would she, would, no, on let, Shark Tank, would she be, be a little specific? Yeah. I wouldn't let her manage a candy store. Wow. Isn't that perfect? Because what he's showing is that's exactly what AOC is. Oh, that, that, I guess that's a weird hand signal that I'm making there. But that is what she is in that she's a really good salesperson, I suppose. I mean, I find her vile and disingenuous and everything else, but, but I can't deny that she's bamboozled a large amount of people. So that's one road that she's going down. But at the same time, there's a parallel road and that parallel, or I guess they're dividing roads going in different directions. So she's got this career track that seems to be going in the right direction for her. It'll be really good for her. But what's going on in her own district is an absolute disaster in terms of crime and immigration and everything else. And real quick, I'm sure most of you remember this, what they're referring to is those 10,000 jobs that Amazon was gonna bring to her district, to her district. And just when they announced that they were gonna bring these uh, factories there and these distribution centers there, all the house prices started going up there because everyone knew all these jobs were gonna come in and it was gonna be great for that area. And then she fought it because she doesn't like big business. And then 10,000 jobs just disappeared. So instead of 10,000 new jobs in her district, she now has a, an untold amount of illegals and crime and drugs and all the rest of it.